Good morning people, um, yeah I'm teaching today so I'm going to be doing a vocal, teaching a vocal class today, later on this morning so I'm just going to switch everything on so that I can take the lesson. Do you know what I mean like? How are we all today? Did you have a good day yesterday? Anyway, now I've got to get ready. Don't want to be late. So for this morning, I am having my usual, which is the aloe gel, my supplements, be pollen and be propolis, coffee, and I might just add in some paracetamol because I kind of feel um, a bit run down. <clears throat> um, yeah, I've got a bit of a coleslaw thing going on my lip, which you'll probably see later. So this is my comfort food. <laughs> I wanted a plate of blueberries, but I've run out. And these two cups are for warm water for later on when I do teach the vocal class. Um, it's always best to have warm water. So I've boiled it now so it will cool down for when um, my next student arrives a bit later on. Anyway, I've really got to get on. Because <laughs> she's coming soon. Okay, so... You are going down to my home studio, okay? This is a little bit of what it looks like. Bit of seating area, some gaming area. Yeah, so it has everything that I need to produce and record. So, this is where I take the lessons, vocal lessons which I, I teach. And um, right now I just need to centre myself and get my right hair. Anyway, sorry. I need to focus on the lesson that I'm going to give so that um, she goes away feeling like she's learned something. Uh, that's really important for me. I need to make sure that they go away every time, learn something and learn something new, not just about music, but also have learned something about their own vocals, their own sound, their voice, and that there's a progression. So I'm just going to get focused on the topic for today's lesson because she's coming in about 10 minutes, so I'll see you in a bit. Yeah, okay, so, so what we're going to do first is we're going to go through the breathing exercises and then we're just going to um, we can do this one first. La now just gonna get a few things um... right guys for those of you who've seen my other vlogs you'll notice that this is a different car this is our newer car um, yeah we used to have a sunroof here there was lots of light flooding in but yes seeing as the car just broke down didn't want to work we had to get a new car so we had to say hello goodbye to Holly and say hello to, I can't remember what the boys named this car, Stephanie or Stacy. have no idea why they're girls' names. I think this car looks like a Bert. <laughs> anyway, I'm just going to pop out because I need to get a few things. Um, so you can come along with me. Yikes. Okay. Oh, today I have got a little bit flustered with myself because I don't like to do things um, I like to do things as I plan them and so when it doesn't go to plan it kind of like puts me off or what's the word I feel disappointed in myself because I think I put unnecessary pressure on myself I've always been like that I'm pretty like that in the studio as well so for instance if I have a rift or 
something I'm singing, let's just say I've sung it like, oh, oh, yeah. And I think, oh my goodness, that's disgusting. <laughs> when it actually isn't so bad, but I've become a perfectionist with everything I've done. And I want to get back in the studio and I want to do it again. So I'll do it a thousand times. It's not necessarily sounding any better. It's the same. I've just done it many different times. Um, and I guess today I feel like I, just because it's not going the way I wanted it to go today, it's a little bit late. I should have been at home doing some other things right now. But hey, I guess in life it's just like that, you know? Um, you don't have to be like that because you know what? Mistakes come and mistakes are there to really help us, I think. I used to think that I can't make a mistake. I don't know, are you like that? Because I, I, I've been like that for years as long as I know me. Um, so mistakes are there so that we can learn from them, to, so that we can get better from them, so that, um, yeah, so there can be change. So I embrace it today, I embrace it, I embrace the different things that I have to learn. I have to learn patience, that's one thing, and to be patient, and also to roll with the punches. And I guess it highlights that I'm not prepared. If things have changed or things haven't happened to the way they're supposed to have, have gone, then it means that I haven't prepared myself properly. You might be thinking, Mel, you're a little bit too hard on yourself. Just live your life, girl. Trust me, I live my life. But if you're like me and you like a bit of structure, with a bit of balanced of, you know, an easy life, it would frustrate you if things don't go to plan. But anyway. Just thought I'd say that because that's how I was feeling. Now, what I'm doing right now, I'm just going um, on my way to my local shopping market. I'm going to get a few things for the house because we um, don't have any food. <laughs> so thanks for yesterday, guys. Those of you who did actually um, make a comment, it was very encouraging. Thank you very much. I um, would have posted them regard regardless of your comments, but thank you. It was very, very, very encouraging. So here I am. Go on, lady. Um, yeah, so I'm here now. I don't really want to take you along the aisles of this shopping place. So I will see you soon. So I'm just going to go into the pound land and more, see if I can get by a really nice glass container to put my, my uh, shea butter mix in. Something like this would be really nice. Everything. in me, yeah.